What's up, everybody? This is Carl from Tech for Goodies, and this is the Domi Fan S2 triple screen monitor for your laptop. So let's give it a try. So like I said, this is the Domi Fan S2. It's a triple screen laptop screen extender. So in general, you have your laptop, which is here in the middle with its built-in screen, and then two additional screens that come out from the side for extreme productivity. So I'm really excited to try this out. I have this laptop that I typically record my audio on. We're gonna go ahead and open this sucker up, see what comes in the box, and then try out the product itself. Oh, and thanks for the folks at Domi Fan for sending this over. I'm really excited to try it out and share it with you. So in the box here, ooh, very nice. And the entire device itself, it looks like it has this sort of leather case container. I'll also show you that if you do purchase it now, they will also send you a full like laptop case, which was pretty nice. It's basically a, I think about a 15 to oh, maybe even a 17 inch full laptop case that you can use to carry this plus your laptop around in. So that's pretty nice to get for free. Then in the box, we also have one, two, three, four cables. First one is USB-C to USB-C. Second one is the same, one for each monitor. They also give you the option for a USB-C to a HDMI, which is nice in case you wanna take an HDMI device, which I'll show in a little while. And then also you have a USB-A to a USB-C. So inside the provided case here, they have both of the external monitors on the inside here. Looks very nice. And again, this is just like a little carrying case if you wanna carry it around, which is also nice. But it looks like they have uh, a sort of carbon fiber outside. If you can see that here, it's sort of a carbon fiber looking outside. And the way that this works is that it folds up into two individual monitors. You're able to basically, as you can see here, pull this apart, be able to fit like a larger monitor. And it looks like it comes with this protective, protective film on both of the monitors. Very nice, very nice. All right, and then that's it. I mean, I think it's uh, safe to say that we're ready to go ahead and hook this thing up. And just so you see here on each one of the monitors, it does have three different USB-C. So I think we're gonna rearrange the desk a little bit here and give this sucker a try. Now that we've got the desk reconfigured up a little bit here, I've got my laptop here in the middle. As you can see, I am still recording my, <laughs> I am still recording my audio on here while we're doing this. But the one good thing about this Domi Fan device, the triple monitor device, is that it gives you multiple ways to hook things up. On my particular laptop here, and that's one thing you need to make sure, is that you have a laptop with a USB-C port on it, maybe two USB-C ports on it, that support video out. Some of the USB-C ports only to support data, and you can basically take a look at sort of their help site or this little sheet right here. You can see if it has one of these symbols, then you should be able to support this device, right? So you could, because it's got two monitors, you're gonna need two different video outputs. You need the USB-C out and HDMI out. And like I was saying, the good thing about this is that they provide all sorts of cables because what you might find is that if you have to use the HDMI port, HDMI port does not support power. So you have to have an extra cable to bring power into the back of the monitor. So let's go ahead and hook this up. One thing I wanna show you is how to operate this kickstand in the back. So because this device does add extra weight to your laptop, you don't want it uh, falling open while you're using it. So they give you a kickstand on the back here. You just open up the kickstand like this, you turn it, and then you're able to slide this kickstand out to give you whatever viewing angle that you want into one of the little slots and you're good to go. I'm gonna go ahead and start it, let's say about here, and then we will go ahead and open up the monitors, slide it around the back. And it's all hooked up. You wanna make sure that each side of these little parts right here hooks on the front of your monitor. Now we are all set. So I have this tilted back a little bit so you can see it from the top town view camera, even though it is an amazingly wide screen view. I will show a little bit more shots at the end of this once I get it all hooked up, but I have it basically in the top down view so you can see how I'm getting it hooked up. All right, so, so far we've basically hooked it onto the front of the monitor 
and we're ready to hook up some of the cables. Now I have a USB-C port that does support video out. So please connect this port to our product. I'm gonna hook it into the monitor, bring the cable around the back here and plug it into the USB-C port on the side of my laptop. Once you do this, you now have two total displays. Now the good thing about these displays is that it has a little rocker panel on the top here so that I can go ahead and change the volume up and down. I can go ahead and change color temperature, brightness, all that kind of stuff. Anything that I want to control, I can do it from this nice little rocker button here on the top. So let's hook up the other monitor. Now in this particular case, my laptop has only one USB-C port. So I'll go ahead and demonstrate how to use the HDMI out. So what they give you is basically a USB to USB, USB-A to USB-C cable. This is gonna provide the power to the monitor because HDMI doesn't have power. And they also give you a USB-C to HDMI, okay? Because on the back of these three monitors, they have three USB-C ports to give you the ultimate flexibility in how do you wanna hook this up. So I'm gonna go ahead and hook up the HDMI. Then I'm gonna hook up the USB-C and you can't see this here, but there's three ports right here. And the bottom one is for HDMI. And then I also have the USB-A here. I'm gonna hook up to my laptop. And again, this is for power. And this goes right here into the type C. Okay, now the red light's on, the monitor is on, and I am sitting pretty right now. So I've got basically a laptop with two external monitors. Right now, I've got one of them is being cloned and one of them is being extended. Let's go ahead and organize my monitors here. So I'm gonna say extend on the desktop one and two. Okay, that gives me three screens and you can see one is in the middle, two is on the right. So if I, so let me show you here. Let me go ahead and let me go ahead and drag this over. So two is over here on the right and three is over here on the left. So I'm gonna bring my sound monitoring. So now in the future, you can see if I want to be able to monitor multiple things on this laptop while I'm filming, I can do that. And one thing to note about the monitor setup here is that you can actually drag these monitors around. Now I don't wanna do that because now that puts this monitor on the right over to my left, but in Windows, you're able to basically drag these around on the off chance that when you hook these up, the right one is on the left and the left one's on the right. You can drag them around and get everything set up and then that will work great. So now we have a complete setup here that's looking perfect, ready for me to use with three individual monitors on my laptop. But here's one of the extra cool things that I wanted to show you about having this triple monitor set up is that you don't have to use the monitors for just your computer. Now, granted, I have it set up here right now with the main screen and two side screens, but I went and grabbed a switch so I can show you how to set it up so you can basically just swap over and play games on one of the monitors. So I'm gonna go ahead and move my audio recording over to the other screen here. This is the one that's gonna remain my screen. And this is the one that's hooked up to HDMI. So I'm gonna go ahead and hook up the switch to that. So as you can see, I've got the switch into my switch dock here. I put it on the side so you can actually see it from the top down view. And then all I'm gonna do is take the HDMI cable and I'm gonna plug it into the back of the switch. And there we go. And now if I wanted to come in here and play games like Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, I have my audio on this side, main window on this side, and then Zelda playing over here on this side. And to be honest with you, it's so wide, I have a hard time keeping it in my camera view. So yeah, I think this is an absolute winner. And I'm excited to use this every single time I'm working on this laptop because I mean, one screen is just too small. You can't do anything with it. Having three screens, three wide screens on my laptop is gonna be incredible. Another thing I could do is I could bring the live feed from this camera down HDMI into one of the monitors, have this monitor on the right recording my sound, and then put maybe Canon Connect on the main screen right here to show all three things that are going on while I'm filming. I think we got a winner here, guys. Again, thanks for the folks for Dummy Fan for sending this over. I'll leave the link down below. Toss me a like or a thumbs up on this video and subscribe if you want to keep watching some of my videos. I really appreciate that. But until then, this is Carl from Techful Goodies and I'm out.